Hello, my name is Kinju and today I will present Smart Shopping Trolley. Uh, in this presentation, we will cover the background for a Smart Shopping Trolley, resources required for implementation of Smart Shopping Trolley system, required changes, effect of innovation, costs and benefits, sensitivity analysis, conclusion and recommendation. Let's start with the background of Smart Shopping Trolley. Before some year, IBM researchers found the difficulties in shopping like uh, long queues in uh, billing, then the confusion about the product and the information of the product. Then the IBM developed a smart shopping trolley in the US. Uh, in recent days, some are being tested in the store and others are in the very stage of development. It uses the RFID system and Zigbee. Uh, when a customer uh, customer uh, registered in this uh, tablet, uh, the tablet received the relevant data and uh, information via the Zigbee model. Technology orient, uh, this is the technology oriented and reduced cost and it mainly designed for a time saving shopping experience. Let's know how it works. Um, when the customer enters into sh in the shopping mall, the customer registers in the sh uh, system in the tablet and then identify themselves. Then after the customer will be able to use the smart trolley. The smart trolley will help to organize the shopping list. It will also help to the manage the budget and uh, it also is to searching some particular product as it uh, uses the GPS. Uh, then when the customer finish the its shopping and when it uh, press the button finish it will uh, automatically direct to the is the billing uh, bill will automatically generated and displayed in the given LED screen customer can pay the bill by credit or debit card by, by the tablet the resources are required for the smart shopping trolley is uh, in hardware um, a disk, RAM, processor and server. In the software side it will require a Windows, iOS, Android for the tablet and uh, customer support application to support the customer and staff support application to support the staff. Uh, at the database uh, it will require some databases like uh, inventory database, customer database, purchase order database shopping list database and uh, in the networking side it will require the RFID antenna, transporter, RFID tag reader, Wi-Fi router and firewall. Uh, these all are the attached to the trolley and uh, the one thing which is the main important in this smart shopping trolley is the tablet which is attached to the trolley and uh, it will in this tablet, uh, it will install the uh, customer support application. Will install in the, this tablet to support the customer in their shopping. Uh, in store, in store devices is a Wi-Fi access and wireless barcode scanner to scan the product. It requires some changes like uh, as a customer perspective, table with uh, it will require the tablet tablet with Wi-Fi enabled to set the products, then barcode scanner to the scan the barcodes uh, barcodes of uh, product, then customer support application. Uh, same as uh, in supplier perspective, it will recall it will require tablet with Wi-Fi enable and stock ledger function to manage the stock. Uh, this function will uh, will help to supplier to see which product is about to finish and they can fill it. They can refill it again and they will manage the stock easily in all over the store. The effect of the innovations are at the HR level, it will reduce staff uh, as less people will need it for the customer service. 
then printing requirement will change uh, because of the whole system will change training will focus as per the customer application and uh, the training customer service will also somehow change then sales and marketing level marketing uh, store can market uh, so store can marketing to the trolley tablet they can show the advertisement of different product on the tablet and they will use the new promotional skills and they can generate a revenue by advertisement of product on trolley at the finance level it will require some uh, investment but they can earn more, more profit because the customer will attract to shopping by uh, to shop by the smart uh, shopping trolley so this will definitely increase the sales now let's see the cost of the implementation uh, here we are talking about the 500 units of the trolley which is more than enough to enough for one store so we require uh, about five 500 LCD displays then three servers 10 hard disks to show the product data of the product then one processor At the software level we require um, operating system for tablets then customer support application and staff support application at the networking side we require uh, about 25 Wi-Fi router the router is depend on the area of the store so it will vary then RFID readers uh, it will require one liter for uh, each uh, each trolley so 500 reader 500 RFID tag then 500, 500 barcode scanner one antenna transporter firewall to save the data and to prevent the unauthorized access then at the labor cost uh, system setup cost will be $300 per unit and the training and development uh, is necessary for the system so it will uh, cost uh, $4,000 then the maintenance at the initial year when we uh, set up the the system at, the, at that year we don't need to put anything in the maintenance but after after first year to fifth five year we have to maintain the system we have to upgrade the software we have to support system support maintenance the all the cost is uh, all the costs are included here <coughs> and the uh, the benefits of the implementations are at uh, initial year we don't uh, have any benefit from the implementation but from the first year to the five year the benefit will increase by year by year uh, as per the spreadsheet uh, labor cost will increase uh, it will reduce the labor cost so the profit will be increased year by year then the other cost will reduce as we can see in the spreadsheet and total saving will increase um, in first year the total saving is uh, seven lakhs fifty thousand dollar and at the five at the end of the fifth year uh, the total saving is eight lakh eighty thousand dollar so it will increase year by year the sales the sales um the sales will increase um from first to five year by 50 uh, 50 50 percent and the revenue also will increase um for 20 percent in first two years and for 50 percent from the rest of three years the total benefit will increase from 11 lakh 70 thousand dollar to 19 lakh 80 thousand dollar in sensitivity analysis uh, we can see that 
total benefits are increased uh, from first to five year and uh, it will continuously increase year by year depreciation is a uh, twenty thousand dollar per year and it it's a constant for each and every year uh, net profit will increase and uh, the tax will count the 20 percent of the profit so the profit after tax is uh, in first year it will hold at eighty thousand, and at the end of the fifth year it will be 11 like 28,000 the discount rate is uh, 10 percent where the NPV is positive so it's a good sign for the company company can implement this uh, this project easily so because it will uh, it will be in a favor of the company and uh, payback period is 3.65 yeah. so it is a good and PI is 3.63 so it's a good sign for the company to uh, to implement the project in conclusion it will increase uh, smart trolley system is uh, will increase the sales um, it, it will also increase the customer base uh, it will reduce the main power it will increase the revenue and NPC is positive so it's a great for a company recommendation for the smart trolley system is it will need proper training for a new system Mm, because to provide a better customer service software maintenance is necessary if, uh, if we update if we update some product or if we ready or if we um, add new product so at that time we have to maintain the software we have to update the software as per the necessary and of course initial investment is too high but uh, the benefits of the smart trolley system is uh, too good for the company so it's a too good it's a very good proposal to any of the store and thank you